we are going to take a look at something that is a little more different from what I typically do, but it's all the rage in the EDC community, and that is the Nux. And this one here is a Lucas Burnley Baldly Contra Cypop with Mars Valley, Carbon Fiber, and Thai Mix. So, very interesting to take a look at it. I bring some of this oddity, pocket trash, pocket art in to take a look at because it is all the rage, just like the pouches. It's all the rage in the EDC community. And I think that we should take a look at some of it because it is all part of the community. And we should, we'll do a lot of different things down the road with some of this stuff. And, whether or not we find it really useful or not. But it is interesting to take a look at some of this stuff because like these Burnley, they, they sell out like crazy within seconds. I'm surprised these are at Blade HQ and they're still in stock. I, he made a bunch of them and surprisingly enough, they're not sold out yet. And I can't believe that. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. All right. Now let's open this bad boy up and let's see what we got. Nope. Let's give you the packaging details there. Like I said, these Cypops are super insane. They sell out the titanium and the copper and the brass alone. They uh, sell out very, very quickly. Oh, yeah. Very, very cool. It's actually really kind of cool. Like some people call it a finger duster. You, know, you can kind of, it's a fidgety little thing. You can kind of spin it around in your hands. It's also a bottle opener. Um, some people would say that, you know, it could be used for some other things, which is kind of what they were designed for to be kind of inconspicuous. I do love this lava float type carbon fiber. I have it on my PM2. We have titanium on this side. It's very interesting, very interesting indeed. Very well made. There's no sharp edges or anything. It's all nice and smooth. So, all in all, it's very interesting. It has this little maker's mark ground in up there. And you can change these too. They are screwed together, so he does make other tops. You can change tops around. So, very, very interesting. What else is in here? Something. Oh, he's got... Okay, so he's got a sticker in there. And, yeah, it gives you information. You know, Zero Blast tie, Fat Carbon Fiber. Okay, very, very cool. Yeah, it's very interesting. Like I said, I thought it was really be cool to really just kind of, kind of take a look at it because like I said this little pocket art pocket trash as some people would say is kind of all the rage these days and so and I haven't been able to actually snag a full tie version which is what I've been trying to snag and like I said they sell out very very quickly and within seconds it's just amazing it's amazing how quick they sell out I don't have my PM2 handy, but my PM2 has, you know, the lava flow scales and it's sharp. So this kind of goes along with that. So very, very cool. I'd like to see a lot more things with the, the red lava flow scales. It's very, very cool. It just has that unique where it looks black and then it looks silver and it just, it's very, very cool. And being backed with titanium, you definitely have the rigidity to sit there and pop bottles if you're popping bottles all the time but yeah very very cool doesn't weigh much of anything and like I said this is kind of all the rage to go along with your pouches that's why all the pouches have the all the little pockets and stuff let's see if I got a pouch handy real quick here yeah a garage built gear so you know they're all the rage to to slip into your little pockets, which that doesn't fit in that pocket. <laughs> Imagine that, huh? So, yeah, so fit in there. Some people put lanyards on them. It's kind of funny that it doesn't fit in like one of those pockets like that. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> but yeah, 
So I think there's one pocket it fits in. So <laughs> very interesting. Never to say the least, but there you guys go. That's just a quick little look at the the side pop from Burnley. Very, very cool. They you got if you get interested, they are still in stock over at Blade HQ. So if you want to check them out, go ahead. Other than that, when they sell out, God knows if they'll ever be around again. So, all right, guys, have a great day. We'll catch you next time.